Sprout, come put your clothes on. I usually start my day at 5.30. How do you put your shoes on? Mm. You, can tell, you can take your new Play-Doh. Come on. And I get my, take my shower, get myself together, pack, make sure my bags are packed. You don't want to go this morning? So I've got to stand up. Grab the kids, we grab the food out of the refrigerator, get loaded up in the car, and we start our day. So I usually typically leave the house about 7, 7.15 to get going to work. When I look for daycare providers, I was looking for somewhere near my job. So in case of emergency, my kids would be closer to me to get to them. Okay. To charge somebody three hundred dollars a week for one child, I just think is ridiculous. You want excellent care, but you don't want to have to choose between food and take your senior child to daycare. Nothing? You hungry? That's when I start to look for licensed quality providers that would have small home daycare that were more family oriented. I'm paying child care for my youngest two. And I have two in college full time that I have to pay for because they don't get enough financial aid. So I have to pay for I have to help them pay for that because I just cannot let them live their dream of getting an education. Ready? I looked into the CAPS program and I found I didn't qualify. You have to work a certain amount of hours in order to be qualified and you can't make over a certain amount. Usually I pay half or a little over half, which is a great opportunity for, for working parents. It just didn't benefit me because I'm of the income qualifications. So most families are two income family. So the option of staying at home with my, with my infant, it wasn't an option for me. And it's not an option for a lot of parents. Unless they're gonna change the laws where my job can still cover me and pay me FMLA until I stay at home until my child at least two. That'd be different, but that ain't gonna change those laws. It's still a struggle somewhat to get daycare paid, but we manage it and we maintain because they have to go to daycare because I have to go to work. Well, I'm finally at work and I get to this all over again starting at 5 30. For me, the, the struggle is real and it's it's something I live every week. 